Oh, for fuck's sake. What up, YouTube? Yeah, so what? I'm shirtless. So what? I'm eating. So what? This is all getting recorded through here. Oh, shit. I don't know if that changes the audio quality, but what's up? Um, I had an epiphany last night. People don't change. People don't change at all. People simply allow you to see certain aspects of their lives. And if that's 100% them, then it's 100% them. Close that window. So, as I was saying, people don't change. They don't. If you are given privy to someone's information later on and it shocks you, it's because they withheld information. It's because they had something in them and they were lying to you or they were just withholding the truth or they just didn't want you into that particular part of their life. What's causing me to say this? I don't want you to know, YouTube. I don't want you to know. All I'll tell you is that YouTube's always gotten me, who I am, truthfully. Crazy, weird, shirtless, Batman. and random, and a hunchback, also. So to end thoughts from the dinner table, to end this whole conversation. If you feel slighted by somebody, it's probably because your first impression of them was wrong. Even if it was right, your first impression of them, first impressions aren't first discoveries. They're not, I mean, they're first discoveries, but they're not 100% of that person. So as time goes on, they may not actually want you in their lives anymore, which is a sad, sad, horrible fact to face, <clears throat> but it's true. Could be true. And over time, when they don't want you in their lives anymore, they don't want to hurt you, so they just go away. Front door. But that's why I'm thankful for really, really, really good friends who from day one have told you who they are. Like, Alan! I'm always right on time. Woo!